Kia and I am back finally getting to these new converted caps like I'm gonna tell you right now yes yes to curvy addiction and I'm addicted to this texture because it is literally mimicking my own okay so um if you saw at the beginning how wild my leave I was looking I prepped my hair blow dried it flat iron because i was like i am not doing that in the review i want it to solely be able to be ready so i can focus on the unit itself and i am really pleased like this is what i'm talking about like this right here is yes all day all day love the texture love the style but let's talk about just the general specs and then I have a surprise because I got a second color, but it was actually a color that I usually don't get. Hint, hint. Okay. So, yes. All right. So, Converti Cap. Yes. Y'all know this is like probably my favorite like line out of Altrey, believe it or not. I just, I love this line. I love the different styles and so i was just really excited when i saw them bringing some more straighter yakky looking blowout texture type you know styles and could not wait to get my hands on her and i'm so glad that um she is just serving exactly what i knew she was going to serve so this is curvy addiction okay um i have her in the color 1b that's what i have on right now so heat resistant up to 400 degrees, okay? So you can put heat to her. And as y'all saw, I was putting heat to her as I was like getting my leave out to kind of like shape and form to how I wanted her to be. 
I actually had her at 365 on my flat iron here so did not even have her up that high because I had already flat ironed my hair so I'm like not trying to overdo it with the heat I just was more so kind of like getting my natural hair to kind of like merge to with the uh hair itself and obviously you see not with a lot of heat at all she did exactly what I needed her to do and she looks great okay and like I said, you know, with me personally, I love to like bring this forward in style. So, you know, you utilizing your leave out, but, you know, shape her and use her as if she was, you know, growing out of your hair. Okay. So safe up to 400 degrees. And I did not even go up that high. Uh, 365 is what my flat iron is uh, on currently. Plenty of colors, but like I have stated in some of my newer converted cap reviews there's more dr2 color options versus dr color options okay when i say that dr chocolate cream none of that um they only have the dr black cherry but they have dr2 um in multiple colors so if you do have like that brown tint hair you know it is catering to your color if you do have that dr2 color if you do have that dr color type you know going on in your hair dr2 you can definitely um you know pick some colors especially if your hair is not a dark root like mine which is you know black hair okay and those are some of the colors that are in the color chart okay and you can see those colors on the back of your card here all right bacteria resistant cap um, you guys know I love the bacteria resistant cap. Um, I have worked out with a converted cap bacteria resistant cap. I also have worked out with the mesh cap that they were putting on the converted cap when they first came out. And both are great, but you know, with me working out, um, I don't have dandruff or anything like that. But if you have dandruff, if you have any kind of scalp um, issues, this is a really good um, feature, you know, especially if you're into half wigs. And you know, you just have that, you know, bacteria resistant, but it's not just catering to bacteria resistant, it's bacteria resistant, which means it's to resist any bacteria, which means if you have it or if you don't, it's gonna resist, okay? So basically that is what that feature is for, especially if you are reviewing my review for the first time and you are not familiar with the converted cap. So those of us that know the converted cap, we know we know the features, but if you are watching for the first time, that's why I'm being a little bit more detailed and going over the features of the converted cap line, okay? So, so you can do multiple styles. That's what the converted cap is all about. I typically do the leave out look. That is just pretty much what I do, but I'm uh, depending on the style, like I had actually a lot more leave out for this style than I would if it was a curly unit. So I did more of the leave out look and not like the leave out look slash foolproof, which is actually just having it very, very close to the edge and using the hair itself to hide, you know, basically, you know, showing that it's a wig. Okay, basically, so it's the foolproof look, okay? And um, you can do that more so to me easier with curlier units than a unit like this but um definitely the start car model she's showing like with the hair um braided uh, in the front and then like having a little headband kind of uh situation going um an updo basically um being able to pull it off that way and um just doing like kind of like a half up half down situation so you can do plenty with the converted cap okay that is like the great thing is it's like even if you never wear it as a ponytail the fact that you could and you can that's it's better to have the option than not basically <laughs> what the converted cap to me is it's like i may not ever wear this unit in a ponytail but if i needed to i can basically okay so that is um one of the things that i love as you saw as you saw 
cap construct. You have a medium comb in the center. You have two smaller combs on the side. And then you have a small comb in the back. And you have the adjustable drawstring. I adjusted the drawstring just a tad bit because I like it to kind of be snug. And I tucked those combs underneath my silicone headband that I had going from, um, you know, after my leave out, you know, I had it pretty much on there. So that's what I usually do when I wear my converted caps. I have a, the silicone band on. I just like the silicone band because it's just, to me, a lot more secure. And I don't have any issues, um, you know, when I'm, wearing her that way okay so yeah I am really loving the style like I was like okay I see y'all and also you can do like a high ponytail too if you see the start mark model right here she's got it in um a higher ponytail yeah you're not limited to not even doing that you can do it I also have Mia Moore, which I will be reviewing, you know, so be on the lookout for that. I haven't even opened the packaging or anything, so I'm not, I haven't felt the texture to compare against this unit. But if I had to compare Curvy Addiction to any other units that have come out, Kiss and Tell that came out a couple months ago, that is one that is um, pretty close um, in texture. You know, she's just a little bit, um, you know, layered with the wave and curve and because density wise she's obviously longer and density wise a little bit thicker but texture wise she is even comparable to hawaiian hottie like it's the cut i think it's the way they cut that and i'm feeling like you know when i'm running my fingers through her like it feels really good um so i am really pleased with that and once I brushed my, you know, brushed her and got her, you know, going, like my hands are running through her, okay? I'm not getting any shedding, which I'm happy about. <laughs> no shedding whatsoever. And you could also compare her to uh, Slaycation. You know, Slaycation is more just bone straight uh, a little bit. Um, layering is not as much detail as this. And um, Slaycation to me is just a, maybe a little bit um, thicker, close to density though. Density is close, similar. Um, if you, you know, thinking like, okay, if I purchased a converted cap before, you know, what is she reminding me of that's similar in style as far as the other ones that have come out, okay? So, yeah, I love this style. Like, <laughs> she might just be worn tomorrow. But let's do a 360. So from the side, okay, she's coming right in past the center. If I'm sitting up straight, she's right at the center, a little bit, a little bit past it. Nice length, okay. All right, all the hair to the back. As you can see, really nice layering. Very nice. I love just the style. Feels really good. And then, of course, bringing her to the front. Y'all know I love the side. Little bringing her to the side. Yes. Yes. So, I have her in the color DR Black Cherry. Shout out to my, the subscriber that recommended for me to check out the dr black cherry i'm gonna put her, her up here and shout her out um i was like kind of hesitant to do it but i was like you know what why not <laughs> okay <laughs> if it's the only dr color i could get i'm gonna get it i'm actually surprised that they did not have like a sb 130 I, I was like really like i can't believe they don't really have you know if they, they're gonna do away with you know dr colors at least have like the highlight you know colors available but they didn't have that so let me take her off and get her situated let me take the 1b color off and plant the dr black cherry i haven't purchased any color red or burgundy in forever so it's gonna feel really weird <laughs> 
uh girl, i haven't done it in so long but i look forward to seeing what she what she's uh bringing okay so let's switch it up <laughs> curvy addiction in the color dr black cherry i am impressed um really thought that the black cherry was gonna be overpowering but it's really uh nice My hair is blending still pretty good in the front um loving the uh texture once you you know brush and comb she's uh acting right um not getting i got like one or two strands of, of shedding it's really more so after i brushed but that's it um behind the ear really good you know blend from black to the actual color um i'm actually impressed with this color did not think i was gonna like it but i'm actually really glad that uh I decided to get her in the color DR Black Cherry. So, yeah, and you guys know I like to like tuck and hide. So that's what I that's what I do. Okay, Black Cherry, I see you. I see you, Black Cherry, popping off off of my purple. Okay, I see you. All right, this is a good color. Oh, I'm not used to it quite. And it's crazy, right? Because I'll, I'll sit here and say a black a DR, I'll sit here and say a DR chocolate swirl is normal <laughs> when that's lighter, right? <laughs> um, I like it though. I'm actually like, man, I'm gonna have to like switch it up and try a black cherry. Try a black cherry from the converted cap because my thing is just because it say dr black cherry on this line don't mean that it's going to be the same on other lines because i have done that too where i'm like oh it's the same dr 2730 uh no it's not so uh let me know what y'all think about uh this color and this overall style do you think this was a good addition to um, the other straight uh, blowout texture styles that they have, like Kiss and Tell, like Slaycations, like Hawaiian Heidi. Is this like a good addition to those you know, styles that are similar? Um, I love this style. I really, I think the texture is great. The cut and layering is on point. This is a really nice, um, style that you can wear any different way uh, for formal occasions for informal occasions you, you know t-shirt and jeans you can rock curvy addiction okay so i think that this is um, a good move for uh converti cap i did not see if they had any more styles 
after this i have like just about every single one i have just about every single style crazy <laughs> i think this is a good addition to those styles that i mentioned that are similar um they they hit it on the nail texture cut layering um density like this is a really good like blend i'm really pleased um i'm actually thinking i will rock her for the day tomorrow because i really am loving what i'm seeing um but i am reviewing mia more so hopefully she don't sway me <laughs> but i'm loving the like looser wave um type body loose body you know that she's giving with these layers and everything else and i'm just really overall pleased um, i'm really excited like i said before i cannot wait to see what more they come out with for the converted cap line um style wise um, I think they definitely should do more shorter units. Um, you guys know I still am into the long hair, don't care mode. So that is me all day right now and I'm loving this, okay? And the fact that this blends really good with my natural hair, loving that as well. I know for a fact if I like, you know, got my edges down and wrapped her up, I'd be curvy and addicted. And tomorrow <laughs> with this style so let me know what you think about this style how does she look on me what are your um, you know views on just like overall this style and what you think they especially the last month um, and some change um, them coming out with the different styles what do you think um, about that and if you purchase her what color and what did you think about her and how so your experience with miss curvy addiction okay so once again thank you so much for tuning into my channel i am reviewing mia moore so be on the lookout it'll be probably uploaded right after this uh, review is uploaded or at the same time so i'm trying to do two birds and one stone <laughs> okay so uh definitely look forward to um getting to her shortly and um seeing what mia moore has to offer but until mia moore please be safe take care of yourselves and continue to stay blessed until the next one be curvy bye and she is definitely addictive okay mm. Thank you.